Mardi Gras is a special day for all of us in New Orleans. Everyone has their own unique traditions and tributes that honors this extraordinary celebration of life. But for many, their Tuesday morning is more than just a sacred ritual steeped in the history and culture of our city. As the sun rises on Mardi Gras Day, all sorts of people gather in Congo Square from the Mardi Gras Indians, the Preservation Hall Jazz Band, to neighbors, family, friends, and curious spectators. Folks from all walks of life come together to partake in a truly unforgettable experience. In fact, this event has been described as a spiritual ceremony involving reflection, gratitude, and shared love of music. You see, Congo Square holds significance when it comes to music and cultural traditions in New Orleans. It's been called a holy place and a sacred ground for its integral role in our city's history. What we know as Congo Square today was once a place where both free and enslaved African people came together to sing, dance, and drum on Sunday afternoons. It was a spiritual place and one that brought communities together to share cultural and religious expressions, which involved into Mardi Gras Indian traditions, second lines, brass bands, and New Orleans jazz and rhythm and blues. But for the musicians who dedicate their lives to protecting, preserving, and perpetuating music and culture of the city, it's in our blood. And while many of our traditions may seem a little different this year, on Tuesday morning, communities across New Orleans will safely carry out their own rituals honoring those who gathered in Congo Square and gave us our culture, our music, our heritage, and most importantly, the very heart and soul of Mardi Gras.